For many of us, pets are part of the family. Yeah, but when you leave your pets with a sitter, do you really know what goes on while you're gone? Well, I team investigator Michael George used hidden cameras to find out. Michael, tell us about it. Well, Wendy Jameson, what we found in our investigation is surprising. Some pet sitters paid to care for your dogs and cats may be leaving after spending only a few minutes on the job. When you leave your pets with a stranger, you trust they'll be taken care of. Using hidden cameras, the I-team wanted to find out if in-home pet sitters really watch your pets for as long as they claim. I am looking to find a pet sitter. We asked Mary Alexander and other pet owners to set up 30-minute visits with several local pet sitters. The visits cost $15 to $23, depending on the sitter. Mary hired Give Me Your Paw Pet Services to watch her two labs for the approximately 30 minutes they promise on their website. All I wanted was for her to give them a half hour of TLC, let them out in the backyard. When the sitter arrived on the first day, she took the dogs out for a walk. But after just four minutes, she came back in filled out a comment card, and took off. Total time at the house, just 10 minutes. The next day, she was in and out in eight minutes. If somebody told me they were gonna give me a half hour massage and they stopped at 15 minutes, I'd be a little angry. Give me your paw pet sitters wouldn't answer our questions on camera, but in a statement, they claim they left early because they were threatened by these dogs. She claims she was greeted by charging dogs with aggressive behavior. Here's what our cameras show when the dogs greeted her. And in three comment cards, she never mentioned any aggressive behavior. She wrote they were barking, but very good. I don't understand why she wouldn't want to have stayed and played with the animals if she's an animal lover. We looked at other home pet sitters as well. Come here. You're a good boy. For years, Joey Trowbridge has been using Wags and Wiggles sitters to watch her three cats, Liam, Lola, and Lucy. I travel on business uh, often. So it's, it's kind of a requirement for me. She says her own security cameras caught the employees skipping out early again and again. Instead of the 30 minutes she says she paid for, her video's timestamps show the sitter leaving in 15 minutes, 6 minutes, and in one visit after just 4 minutes. What are you thinking when you're first watching this video? I was like, you've got to be kidding me. And I thought, this can't be right. This can't be right. Wags and Wiggles responded, quote, her cats are not social cats and didn't want to play. They added, at Wags and Wiggles, it has always been about the proper care and well-being of the animals in our care, not about minutes. They also claim they never promised Joey a 30-minute visit. But in fact, the website does say all visits are approximately a half hour, and we guarantee you will get the time you paid for. Or at least the website used to say that. After we told them about our investigation, those lines were taken off the website. And I want to trust, you know, a company and to do the right thing. The I team had our cameras rolling as Wags and Wiggles sat for another pet owner in Tampa. But this time, Wags and Wiggles delivered exactly what they promised, walking the dog for a full 30 minutes. Alone at home pet sitters in Largo also gave the dog the full 30 minutes of attention they promised. For the pet owners we spoke with, the difference between 30 minutes and 5 is huge. I mean, these, these are my babies, you know. I, I feel bad. They couldn't tell me, hey, mom, you know. She's spending five minutes here. They couldn't tell me that. I didn't know. I had to find out on the security cameras. Now, the Better Business Bureau says you should get in writing exactly what you expect your pet sitter to do. And you should ask for references before you hire anyone. Now, this story came to us after a viewer called us. If you have a tip for the iTeam, contact us at iTeam at ABCActionNews.com. Wendy. Thanks.